So Bournemouth University, we have 17,000 students and about 2,000 staff. We're here today at our Talbot campus. Dorset House is one of 14 academic buildings on this particular campus. Uh, it's used by staff and students. Fully occupied, the building can be anywhere between 100 to 150 people. Heat decarbonisation is a big part of our action plan. We were successful in being awarded low carbon skills funding to create a heat decarbonisation plan for the Talbot campus. Dorset House, we used to heat this using natural gas and some existing boilers that had come to end of life. So it was identified in our heat decarbonisation plan that this should be one of the buildings that we focus on. So at Bournemouth University, we have been responsible for full installation relating to the uh, acoustic enclosure and the installation of nine air source heat pumps to replace the existing boiler system. The CHVR is our latest product in our commercial heating range and is capable of delivering 70 degrees of hot water. The reason they were chosen is we didn't have to upgrade any of the radiators inside the building. They give a high temperature on heat output inside Dorset House. Each CHVR unit is capable of delivering 40 kilowatts of capacity. Each unit can be cascaded together to reach higher capacities as well, meaning it can be applicable to a wide range of applications. Rather than going for a low temperature heat pump, the work involved having to replace all the pipe work all the radiators and the heating system throughout an operational building at the time was just not feasible and not cost effective. So we needed a solution that could achieve those high temperatures without that work being done. We're keen to create a campus environment that makes it easier for our students and staff to make the right choices for the environment and reduce their carbon footprint. This plan aims to achieve a 50% reduction across all scopes of emissions by 2030-31 against the baseline of 2018-19. So we've had quite a good involvement with Mitsubishi the last few years. We're currently in, um, using heat pumps on about four or five of our projects and we're actually commissioning stuff as we talk. The next steps in our decarbonisation plan is to make steps forward onto the next buildings and opportunities. The biggest input from me will be actually monitoring the performance and the output of this particular system and its suitability and then identify whether this system would be suitable in other faculty buildings as we move forward.